I um, really change when I walk into an apiary and uh, time for me slows down. It's almost a um, meditative, transcendental experience. I become much more present, much more aware of things around me. I may be chatting and talking as I am now, but part of me is immersed on a whole different level in the bees. I'm tuning into how they communicate, uh, picking up um, senses and images from the hive about any issues or problems that particular colonies we're going into may having. I'm aware of what's going on in the environment, what may be blooming. It's a complete full body immersion experience. And I don't think anybody could be around bees for very long without developing a much deeper connection to nature and um, learning a lot more about who they are and who they want to be in the world. When I came to Simon Fraser University, I opened up a bee lab, began getting bee colonies going and getting students. And we at first were interested in similar things I'd been interested in in South America colony dynamics, how colonies grow, how they survive. But uh, we quickly became involved with the British Columbia beekeeping community and be began doing research about producing bees here in British Columbia, about pollination, things that were germane to the local and uh, Canadian industries. Uh, I also connected with a chemist, Keith Slusser, very early in my time here at, at uh, Simon Fraser. And he and I began a lifelong collaboration studying honeybee pheromones and communication which led to probably the most significant findings of my career, which were elucidating the nature and the function of the honeybee queen pheromone. I've had an unusual career in being successful as an academic, but also in being um, very committed to working with um, audiences off campus. And the beekeeping community has been my deepest uh, connection working with bees of course you start talking to beekeepers and I've always um, enjoyed and appreciated those interactions. I have a new book out, um, Bee Time Lessons from the Hive. It, um, I've been thinking about this book for my whole career although until the last few years I wasn't aware of it. I have learned an amazing amount from bees. I've learned about uh, how to communicate. I've learned how to be more present in the world. I've become much more attentive to the environment around me. I've um, paid more attention to food and what I eat from my uh, interest in honey. Uh, I've learned about spirituality, I've learned about art, uh, and I've learned about collaboration and how people work together. And all of these things are subjects that we, uh, we discuss in the book.